The Winter Olympics are now just days away. The Olympic Games open Friday, Salt Lake City, Utah. Athletes are arriving daily. So are the media from all over the world. And today we get a chance to go along for a special aerial tour. NBC5's Amy Jacobson is in Park City, Utah with a look around for us. Hi, Amy. Hello, Allison and Mark, and good afternoon, everyone. Well, did you know that Park City, Utah is 7,000 feet above sea level? Here we are in the most western range of the Rocky Mountains, and up here in Park City, it seems the people are as nice as the weather. What a fantastic day in the neighborhood. The beautiful sights and sounds of Park City, Utah. A town of 7,000 nestled in between the Wasatch Mountains, a town that is getting ready for Olympic-sized crowds. It's interesting <laughs> not being able to drive. It's already all packed, but it'll be neat. Tonight, crews working vigorously, putting the finishing touches on Main Street. Corporate tents constructing facades that keep in line with Park City's turn-of-the-century architecture. It's pretty impressive. Come Wednesday, there will be a no-fly zone over Park City, so photographer Nancy yeah. Gonzalez and I went for a ride to get a bird's-eye view of the three Olympic venues. Park City will have the snowboarding event and giant slalom. Our pilot, Miles Ivers, explains the tranquility at 1,500 feet up. We get a scenic view from the sky. We get to see the whole area. We get the mountains. We get to see over the mountains a little bit. Uh, as you can see on a gorgeous blue day like today, the, the contrast is just incredible. Uh, it's just a very serene, very pleasant feeling. This is unbelievable. And we met one passenger, Abner Snell, who is from Lombard, Illinois. He's here to see some of the games, and now he's getting a chance to see this quaint town from a world-class view. I'm going to see a couple of events and uh, try to go to the, um, the torch as it comes into West Valley City and uh, really have a good time bring home the uh, gold to the USA. Now, many Chicagoans will be here to watch the Winter Games, and the events will be held at three different ski resorts, including this one. We're reporting live from Deer Valley, and this is where the Moguls Freestyle Aerials and Alpine Slalom will be held. And, of course, we'll be bringing you live daily reports from Deer Valley. Reporting live from Park City, Utah, Amy Jacobson, NBC5 News. Amy, as I recall from the time when I got a chance to go up in a hot air balloon, you must have had a pretty early wake-up call. What time was that this morning? I was 8 o'clock this morning, oh. actually, so it wasn't too bad. That's not and bad. how was That's the landing? That's the best time to fly. Yeah. How was the landing? The landing? Was, yeah, Allison, the landing was not rough at all. It was really? very smooth. We had a wonderful ride, and uh, we prepared for a uh, rough landing. But it She was sounds very smooth. relaxed, doesn't she? Man, she had it all. 8 a.m. start time is later than I thought. I remember yeah. the 6 a.m., 5 a.m. <laughs> thing with Jiggy or whatever. But looked beautiful. Yes. Thanks. Pretty pictures. Our NBC5 Olympic team is now in place for the opening ceremonies just four days away. Once the games begin, we invite you to join us for our expanded coverage of the Winter Games and the news beginning at 4 o'clock starting next Monday because of the Olympic Games right here on NBC5.